It's Friday. I'm in the zone. Hang on. Are you in the zone? I said choose. Love in the first degree. Love in the first degree. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. One of the most successful girl groups ever. In fact, they're one of the most successful groups. It doesn't matter whether they're female yeah, really, or not. Yeah. Uh, with over 40 million albums sold and 30 million single sales worldwide. Yeah, 40 years since Banana Rama broke into the UK top 10 with their uh, single Cruel Summer. But four decades on, the hits are just still as iconic. Take a look. Baby, new single feel the love and they're here now to talk all about it oh, wow it's okay. so lovely to have you uh, i'm very excited about this new single i'm not gonna lie i feel the love okay. i'm always feeling the love from you two well very I'm, positive message <laughs> in this one. is that what you want you want it's something yeah, positive yeah. something yeah. uplifting yeah. well we need it in these times don't we yeah we absolutely it was about believing in yourself and not letting people get you down and there's always a light at the end of the tunnel hopefully and is it similar sounding to your old music well, people say it has a nod to the um, to the eighties, but that's quite difficult not to because it's us two. It's your style, isn't it? Yes, yes. I mean, but whatever, it's very whatever dancing. we tackle, people always say, oh, "God, you, you sound like Banana Rama." It's like there's no reason. Banana Rama for me. A little bit too Banana Rama. I'm not happy with that. Do you yeah. still get a buzz listening to your stuff on the radio? Like when you when you when you hear a new song, do you still get that same buzz that you did? Yes, because it's been 40 years. So you think, will people still play it? Will people still want to know? And so when you do hear it on the radio, it's still yeah. It's it's you and yeah. 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 still get Definitely. a buzz when you hear an old one. Yeah. Sort of turn it well, up. Listen, I mean, I was you were there on Radio Two in the park this summer, yeah. and your crowd was insane. Yeah, I, mean, I know. Kind of, like I well, said to you, it was kind. Of, uh, we've played a lot of. Big shows, big festivals, but actually turning up there and um, being interviewed by you, when we looked out at the crowd, it was just like, yeah, amazing. they were phenomenal. Yeah, yeah. and everybody's days. so involved and Incredible, having such a great it? time. Yeah. Uh, all right, well, let's see some of the new stuff. This Feel is, the love. Uh, this is Feel the love. Take a look. That is amazing. I love the feel of this. Of course, this comes from the new album, Glorious. Yeah. Uh, what can we expect from the album? Well, it's a triple kind of vinyl celebrating 40 years. Yeah, four, four decades. decades. Yeah. So 40 it's songs yeah. that we've chosen ourselves. So you don't even look old enough for four decades. No. Oh. Honestly, you look amazing. <laughs> it's mad, isn't it? It does seem ridiculous sometimes. I mean, but, you know. And you remember it like it's yesterday. A lot of yeah, it. Some lot of it, it not so much. And not <laughs> some of it not. A couple of lost years in there somewhere. <laughs> well, um, so you've done, is it six new songs for this? You've written Look, six? We've done, well, we actually wrote six, but we've chosen two to be the singles. Yeah. And then we've chosen, like, some of our favourite cuts and fan favourites. And then the, the hits as well, so it's not like a greatest. I was going to say, have you done a few oh. kind of B-sides and deep cuts? Well, there's like CDs, well, CD, yeah. loads of remixes on. And we've done the most new. fantastic coffee table yeah, book, yeah. which sort of charts the fashion I love that goes that. along with the music. So That was a big thing in the side. I remember West in the 80s. Stuff, stuff that yeah. mostly Sarah still keeps, whereas... In the back of the cupboard, I can't believe
Bit Leave it, it's all like Westwood and Galley. Can you just not get rid of it? Are you a good hoarder for that? Or? Well, it's moss in it. Then again, why would you want to get rid of it? <laughs> why? Like stuff from back yeah, in the day. It's sell it. But the, exactly. <laughs> but I love the story of when you were first starting out and you didn't have any money. You, you were basically, I mean, the fashion came from necessity rather than yes. rather than you being able to go and buy stuff. Yeah. So you, whose grandmother was it? Karen. I had my grandma's sewing machine. We made a lot of stuff and we bought stuff from markets, but we'd alter it and, you know, you cut stuff off and, yeah. Were you studying you textiles or anything to do that? No, I like was reared sewing, making clothes. Yeah. It was, it was always cheap. Fitting, yeah. Unflattering. No, it was a style. I remember back oh in my the day, God, look. the style was everything. Yeah. Like, what are they wearing? What but it was, I think it box? was the do-it-yourself thing. You yeah. Know, with, the, with whatever we wore, people felt it was uh, achievable. We're not wearing sort of Chanel. Yeah, um, like you are today. It's kind of got one <laughs> <laughs> oh, Always, so every day. Pictures, you can wear that stuff now in a heartbeat. Yes. Like and it was funny because my yeah. daughter, you know, thing, things cycle around and then she ended up wearing all my Westwood stuff and it looked much better on it. And I've just <laughs> given her a batch of old stuff as well. Yeah, so, so she's lovely. Yeah, yeah, she looks great in it. I can't believe you were in the Guinness Book of Records for being the most successful female yeah. band. Yeah. Yes. What most done, charted hits. What do you get yeah. for that? Do you get like a little something to put on the We went on a bus with a dog. Whoever was doing it at the moment at the time. <laughs> <laughs> that was really a special <laughs> treat. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't see us losing the record because who else is going to go for as long it's as a memorable us? Well, that's yeah. the thing. It's like so. It's thirty UK top ten or top forty hits, mm -hmm. something like that. That's yeah. amazing. I don't think even I could name them all. No. <laughs> so so say, well, well, now you're that? playing live. That was a lovely thing seeing you yeah. live this summer. Yeah. In that, like you've the body of work you've got. You've got you've got enough you've got enough great singles and great songs for people to come off and go oh they didn't play that you know yeah. that's, that's always know. what you want. And isn't I get it? really upset when you don't play. It, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. And what's lovely is you get new uh, people who can appreciate your music, yeah. younger generation. Yeah. Now. What do they make of it? Yeah, we always peep out before a show and say, oh god, they're really young. Do you think they're not going to know yeah. us? And they do. Obviously yeah. by their and they're all over or whatever. Yeah. yeah. And the Palladium next year, how exciting! Yes. yes. What's happening? The third. Just really exciting because it's all part of this celebrating four decades. It's a legacy. It is a legacy. <laughs> oh, yeah. So how do you, what do you put your energy down to? Because you, you know, you, yeah, you, you just got, you've got great work ethic, and you're just not, not slowing sweet. down. No, do very little of that. Are you in a, a bit of yoga? <laughs> no, <laughs> not at all. Um, I think it's just loving what we do. I yeah. mean, there are moments where you're in a dressing room backstage and you think, oh, I just want to do this again. You know, you, you just go out and you just, it's, the, it's like you said, when, when you hear the crowd sing along, when you see them there, it. it just Absolutely. lifts you and gives you that energy. Yeah, well, listen, you listen, Banana Rubber's new single, Feel the Love, is out now. The new album, Glorious, the Ultimate Collection, uh, released on the 8th, the 8th in 2024. Thank you, so Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, local weather forecast up next. Loads more to come today. Does fruit really lose its nutrients when it's blended into a smoothie? And what about cellulite? Is there a secret remedy to remove it? Dr. Karen is back to help you debunk the latest health mix. All coming up after your local weather forecast. We'll see you in a bit.